Hello, welcome back to Hughes Nursery and today we're going to be growing some nasturtiums. Here I got them from Tamar Organics uh, Trailing Mix. Now the brilliant thing about nasturtiums is that you can eat the flowers, um, you can also eat the leaves. The seeds are really easy to save so all, all in all it's a brilliant um, edible flower that anyone can grow. You can grow them um, in old milk cartons, you can grow them in uh, hanging baskets basically it's just such a simple thing and we, I'm going to show you how you uh, start them off today and then these are all individual plugs in this tray and then when they do grow to about two or three inches high uh, all you need to do is just to go underneath and pop it out or gently pull it out and uh, you can just plant it to wherever you want so we got some nice compost here Try and use a good organic mix and just basically cover it all. Now I have got some exciting things lined up for you guys. Um, there's a contest that's going to be held, the International Longest Bean Contest. I will be doing a video about that, showing you all the stuff you can do and anyone can join. There will be some really cool prizes and it will actually be, a, I think, the main contest so far that I've done. And yeah, anyone can enter, so that will be quite fun. Now, there you go. There you go, move that away. we got a whole... Uh, tray here planted. Now this is, I, I do like uh, potting benches because it's so easy. You got compost in one end and then you can easily grow everything. But uh, it says popular easy to grow bedding plant that has attractive edible flowers as well as edible leaves and seeds. Um, so this is going to be mixed colours. Uh, the two main colours are yellow, orange, well three main colours are yellow, orange and red. And so between March and um, March and May. So just take a look at the seeds. These are what they look like. They look a bit like uh, brains, nearly. Quite funny. But we're just going to go along, making a bit of a depth like this. So about half an inch, I would say. Plant them half an inch to an inch deep. You don't. And then just drop them in. And carry on doing that till we finish. So there, we've almost finished. We need to do you get a bit of compost and just lightly cover over the seeds like that and then there you go that's all finished and planted you will see some sprouts in about a week or two and then once you do see the sprouts just make sure that you leave this in a nice sunny bright spot also keep the compost moist at all times and then soon it will be ready to plant them out. So very simple, hope you enjoyed this and see you again very soon with some more cool videos. Goodbye.